To it, man, it's not like a you know what I'm saying. You got a different type of flow, man. It's like you know what I'm saying. Yeah, it's like you be riding on that, you know, riding on that beat. You know what I'm saying. It, 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 the beat change up. You know what I'm saying. The, the, the tempo might go and, and, and slow down and, and, and it speed back up, man. It's, that's that's hot. That's really hot. I appreciate, I appreciate it, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the whole motivation of it. The whole goal of what I was trying to do. You know, I had I'd be like to do different records man on the album uh, for different occasions you know what I'm saying Gotta, can't leave the script club in the club out there, the women right. out there right that one so, produced who, who, who's producing on that one Desi did that yeah. it's only Desi and uh, Pharaoh the only one they the only one that did the whole album okay it was Desi and then Faro both, so both of them did it okay so you got two yep. producers on that so that means you got a pretty your sound because the funny thing is dude, dude's sound is a little similar you know what I mean it's like it's a congruent it's not like it's not like your album would, would would be off, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, I can test this. Yeah. Dude, it's like it, 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 your sound, it actually comes together. Both of them together yep. are packaged yep. in a nice album there for you. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It wasn't it, it was like it wasn't far off from each other. Like, they kind of feel meshed together. That's, That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. All right. Now. 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 Uh, let's talk a little bit more here. As an independent artist, uh, all right, what's your goal here? I always ask this because, like I said, I used to deal with independent artists a lot. I had a music conference out of Charlotte, the Mid-Atlantic Music Conference, run on 12, 13 years. So, there's two paths here. As an independent artist, do you want to continue doing what you're doing on your own and get a distribution deal or are you looking for a label to get 
to get signed by a label, a major? Um, I, I, I the label, and and then and then do my own label. I want to I want to follow like fifty and Eminem type thing because um man, it's a lot of work, man. If you don't know, you know, it's a lot of work to really run your own label. Just, right. You know what I'm saying like I, um, it's just a lot of work. Not saying I, I don't want to do the work, but I just I just look at the guys like I said like. Tiny, but yeah, some 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 is sometimes your sound going out a little bit. Sometimes uh, I'm a phone, yeah. yeah. I, I say, um, uh, but the uh, you're getting better, yeah. yeah um, but I'd rather follow that, you know what I'm saying? Because it'll just make it a lot easier, you know what I'm saying, to get the deal and then still have your label imprint. Because that's my that's my like, I'm not just an artist, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I have a label as well, you know, but I think it'll be, you know, I, 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 I will take up. Artist deal, slash label deal, no person. I got you. Okay, I got you. That makes sense. That makes sense. Um, because, like I said, it, right now there's no telling what you can do. I mean, you got a little taste of it, right? So yeah. you know what I'm saying you get sales and all that stuff on your own. Like I said, a lot, oh, a lot exactly. of cats ain't, don't even accomplish that. Nor will they push it to all of the, the to the to the the different areas. You know what I'm saying? The different uh. Online venues, the social media impact that you were having. I mean, because, I mean, you working the hell out of IG. <laughs> I see that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, don't twist it. I'm set up for whatever, you know, if a distribution deal do have, if that's what I have to take, I'm, I'm working. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it don't matter what you throw at me. It's just, you know, what I want. But I can go wherever because, like you said, I'm working and I'm doing stuff to, you know, the major's doing, you know, some kind of smaller scale but like you said the, the the average you know local underground rapper is not doing it you know what I'm saying right to the level and, and I'm not bragging anything like that I'm just saying I, I'm i just I know I'm just trying to set myself up where I can get close to what I deserve you know what I'm saying that uh, makes sense know? that makes sense yeah. uh, S- Slugger on the X-Squad of Phillips asked me why did I do my conference in Charlotte as opposed to the A the question now this is let me let me break it down to you, Sluggo. I did this started in two thousand one. Reason I did it there in Charlotte because here in Atlanta everything had you already you could go to the mall and run into just main Dupree. You can go to you know what I'm saying, you you have organized noise. You had all kind of resources and things in Atlanta already in place. So bringing a music conference just didn't make sense because I wanted an untapped region. I wanted an untapped region. So the Mid-Atlantic, which encompassed uh, Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, Kentucky, I was able to get artists and bring them together and bring the resources. We actually had people come up from Atlanta and people come down from New York. So we brought people all over, but I wanted to focus on an area that was untapped. It would have been the same thing if I took it to Alabama. You know what I'm saying? There's, yep. there's talent there. There's talent. Like, like my man here, Rod Main, actually came to Atlanta, but he could have done what he did in Alabama, but he not, Alabama may not have the resources, or they may have the resources, so, but just nobody is actually that. putting them together. Exactly. So that's the thing. You know what I'm saying? There's, there's entertainment attorneys probably in Alabama. There's, there's a distribution company probably out of Alabama. You know what I mean? So it's like we brought all that stuff together so people can network and say, oh, damn, I didn't know you were here. You know what I mean? It was a lot of that going on in Charlotte. So that's a that's a quick. It ain't about me. Let me deflect off of me <laughs> when they ask the question. So, but you understand that being independent artist, you understand what it took for you to actually get your stuff out. You know, what I'm saying you had to leave the area to probably come here to get the resources that you wanted. Yeah, yeah, and uh, you have to do that, man. I mean, like you can still rep, you know, from where you're from. You know what I'm saying? But you have to leave and go get the resources you have to i mean there's no way there's no way around it i feel like are you gonna make it harder it's gonna be harder for you that's correct you know so so that was a 
and he was actually that's why why you left uh, Charlotte. But Charlotte is not as popping as Atlanta. No, 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 no. Yeah, here's actually why I did my music conference in Charlotte because I lived in Atlanta, but I took it out of the, out of town to do it. And, and, and oh, that's, okay. why, that's why I was that's why I was saying is that it was just an untapped area. You know what I'm saying? Even oh, I, I would even took it to Maine. Yeah, I took it there. I took it to Charlotte and had Charlotte people. You know what I'm saying? Trying to trying to focus and magnify on Charlotte artists and Columbia artists and yeah. Greensboro so artists you, and Greensville. Uh-huh. Oh, so you was basically giving them a. A break or a chance or something like that. Yeah. Basically, that's just, yeah. Oh, okay. I got you. Yeah, that works too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, right. So that's how I did it. You know what I mean? But like I said, Atlanta artists came up there too. You know what I mean? So it, it was, it was, it was a regional thing. So it's just I want yeah. to actually focus on that area there. So anyway, that's like I said. Enough about me, bro. It's time. This the single right here. I need everybody to request. This from your local stations. If you are listening to the sound of my voice, we're gonna we're gonna talk about that after we play it. I'm gonna play it, and then you can judge if you like it. Then call your station. I'm gonna let y'all go ahead and judge it, and then if you like it, then locate your favorite station's phone number or their website or their email address and request the song if it ain't playing there now. That's, That's fair it. enough. Yeah. Right. No doubt. Without further ado, let's get no ain't no telling on. Ain't no Produced telling. Produced by my man Faro Jaro. Oh, that. Ain't no telling. Talk about me. What up, low key? What up, Faro? I might, I, might. I might smoke a lot, I might drink a lot, ain't no telling. I might just be rich, I might just be broke, ain't no telling. I might bring it to you, I might let you breathe, ain't no telling. I might just get hurt, we might want to both, ain't no telling. I might got it gone, I might got whatever, ain't no telling. I might got that work, or oh, I'm going to work, ain't no telling. I might pull a phone, I might try to hook, there ain't no telling. I might fuck with you, I might cut you out, ain't no telling. I'm high the sky, plus I'm shining, you know me a star I got all the ice in my balls, I'm a walking drink 150, 20, 10, and 5, like a fucking bank AK Draco, 45, and 9, rolling like a tank What's on your mind? Money, money, only thoughts I have Dollars on dollars, this plus that, that plus that, that mail Man, my car just like a suit, cause she turned to Jarrell Made that play, that money dirty, get that shit a bang Hit your ass with 30. Ooh, he curved. We might just got what you need. Ooh, we serve. Nigga telling on they eyes. Ooh, they working. See the post, but never like. Ooh, you learn. I might smoke a lot. I might drink a lot. Ain't no telling. I might just be rich. I might just be broke. Ain't no telling. I might bring it to you. I might let you drink. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We got to bring that back. We got to bring that back. Go ahead, DJ, bring that thing back there, man. All right, we're going to play that over. Let's start that back from the top again, all right? Ain't no telling. Tell me about me. What up, low key? What up, Farrow? Let's see what up. I might, I might smoke a lot. I might drink a lot. Ain't no telling. I might just be rich. I might just be broke. Ain't no telling. I might bring it to you. I might let you breathe. Ain't no telling. I might just get hurt. We might want to both. Ain't no telling. I might got it gone. I might got whatever. Ain't no telling. I might got that work. Oh, I'm going to work. Ain't no telling. I might pull a phone. I might try to hook. There ain't no telling. I might fuck with you. I might cut you out. Ain't no telling. I'm high the sky, plus I'm shining, you know me a star. I got all the ice in my balls, I'm a walking drink. 150, 20, 10, and 5, like a fucking bank. AK Draco, 45, and 9, rolling like a tank. What's on your mind? Money, money, only thoughts I have. Dollars on dollars, this plus that, that plus that, that mail. Man, my car just like a suit, cause she turned to Jarrell. Made that play, that money dirty, get that shit a bang. Hit your ass with 30. Ooh, he curved. We might just got what you need. Ooh, we serve. 
Nigga telling on they eyes. Ooh, they working. See the Pope never like. Ooh, you learn.